the forgetting set in, and the world fell. Hey, what's happening, gamers? It's Amber here with Kaylin's Let's Play. Hope you guys are all having a great day today. You have and the power great to see everyone in the chat. Again. Hi, Jacob, Orion. Hi, Gameway. Hi, PJ. Hi, the eyes. This dream Hi everyone. Um, yeah, sorry I was late. I kind of lost track of time. I was uh, in the kitchen cleaning, and then I uh, actually made tea and I made bread. So my new my new thing. I don't know if it's not really a New Year's resolution, but what? I figure I can always live on tea and bread. And it's pretty cheap, so, so it's like, well, I'll try to make sure I have that always in the house, and then I am never going to go hungry, so country. that's good. So, uh, yeah. all right, so today we're actually going to go, um, we're going to um, hang out with Goofy, and we actually were able to get two, I was able to get two um, special core things that we needed to complete uh, Scrooge McDuck's quest, so that's exciting. So lots of fun, exciting stuff for today. And if you guys saw earlier, I started again for Animal Crossing. I didn't realize that I would have to actually delete Luke's Island if I uh, if I ended up, um, um, you know, like starting over. So I'm not deleting his island, obviously. <laughs> um, so uh, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna keep going with Luke's Island on Animal Crossing, and I'm just gonna. Uh, I'm just gonna improve his island, hopefully. Put more flowers there, add stuff to the museum. It'll be a nice, uh, hangout, like, early morning, um, thing, so. Mm -hmm. Alright, how's it going? Let's see. Um, let's hang out, Goofy. So, Goofy's actually, a good thing he is actually a Fisher character. So, we need to catch one more Dingle Hopper and one Prisma Shrimp with Goofy. Um, and... Before that, we can actually finish the quest with um, Scrooge McDuck. Ha 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 ha! Yeah, three years of progress not worth starting the game over, says uh, the eyes. Yeah, I mean, like if it was my island, I probably would start it over because I kind of like I don't mind a fresh start, but I'm certainly not gonna like. People in the chat kept saying like delete the island. It's like, well, it's not my island, so I don't have permission to delete Luke's island. Like, I'm not like, imagine how frustrated he would be if I deleted it. I'd be sleeping on the couch or something. Alright, so let's go talk to Scrooge and let's see what his um, Hello. what his uh, quest was. Alright, so gear uh, ah, have you built one of those ancient machines yet? You don't have to build one for garden, you know, but you can do the machine and be quite helpful. Alright, so Bye -bye. we're going to try to build one of his machines. We got, we actually were able to find two ancient cores, so we're going to do that. Um, yeah, and just FYI, I know, like, somebody was pushing the likes a lot in the morning stream, but I, there's several reasons why I don't push the likes as much. Of course, I try to push them in my own way, but I'm not as... Like, my husband uh, has a very business personality. He's also much better at games than me. Um, I don't really want to look like a fool, like, asking people to like the video when I'm really not very good at games to begin with. Um, what I'm doing is kind of just filler content, trying to get views up on the channel. So, you know, um, you know, I, I do try to push the likes in my own way, but I just can't... I. I don't have the personality to push them as intently as Luke. If people want to push the likes, that's completely fine. But just as long as I, you know, you know, it's kind of like I, my, my streams are like the pre-show show. So it's not really the actual streams that need to, you know, really get all those views. So, um, you know, it's more important to push the later streams, uh, but if you want to push the earlier streams, that's completely fine. That that helps out. So, um, I don't mind that at all. Okay, so, uh, so we're gonna go make, um, we're gonna make something with an ancient core. For people that don't have this game, it's probably super confusing watching me do all these tasks, but hopefully 
if you guys don't have the game, hopefully it's relaxing, um, if nothing else. That's what I'm hoping my or afternoon or morning streams can be, is just relaxing, something calm to put on in the background, and that's really all I can hope for. Alright, so we're going to try to do what Scrooge has asked for. So he wants us to make an ancient machine. Why don't we try an ancient gardening machine? And we're going to need 2,000 dream mist points, three ancient gears, three pipes, and two ancient cores. And um, I understand what the eyes was saying because I was uh, playing this this morning on my own, off camera, obviously. And yes, the bigger the rift that you see, the circle when you're, you know, pressing X, 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 X to try to get the, you know, whatever item it is. Um, yeah, if it's a really big circle rift in time, then it's more likely you're going to get an ancient core. So now I understand what that was. Okay, so we were able to do that. Now, okay. Okay, for some reason, we got this. Okay. All right, so now we can go talk to Scrooge and McDuck, and let's see what um, he has to say. I'll just put a time code in here. More convenient than Animal Crossing, you think, the eyes? It's possible. Oh, thank you, PJ says. It's relaxing and fun. You're very sweet. You guys are kinder than I deserve. You're not, you're not good at games. I do not believe that. Thank you, Game Wing. It's very kind. Thank you. Well, you guys are very kind. You guys are too nice to me. All right. Um, oh, good day to you, K-Wing. Uh, all right. Let's see. I have, um, let's see, Village Project. Look at that. You built one of the ancient machines. <laughs> well, why don't you set it down and put it to work for you? Mm. All right, so we've got There's a garden right here. I guess we might as well set it down. All right, so we're going to build... We're going to get this ancient gardener gardening thing, and I don't really know what this is going to do. Um... Uh, well, okay, it looks like we can put it here. So what does that do? Plant seeds or harvest crops with a single action. For the gardening work, you need to be set up on land where crops can grow. Oh no, we harvested everything! Now we're gonna have to find more wheat. Uh, okay, I guess we have wheat here. Hi there, pal. Um, okay. Um, hi, Brandon. Good. How are you doing today? Great to see you. Hi, Timmy the Megan fan. Oh, you're always nice, Timmy the Megan fan. You're, you're always a nice person. Alright, so let's sell... Um, I guess we can sell some of our wheat. Let's keep some of it. We might need to make something with it. I always like to keep, like, seven... Seven pieces of wheat. Whoops. Wait a second. Uh, okay. Well, one, two, three, four, six, seven. Okay. And we're going to sell that. All right. So we sold some of our wheat. All right. So basically this ancient gardening tool uh, did help us a little bit. Now we just have to plant the wheat again. I don't know if we can. Wait a second. Can we plant it? Can we plant it? I don't know. Let's see. Okay. Okay. 
It's not letting me plant it, though. That's weird. Oh, okay. All right, and it planted it, and now I'm just going to water it myself. I don't... But it could water it. Okay, so basically, it does it for you. It planted it all at once. So there we go. We built the ancient, like, technology, the gardening tool. Very cool. Um, good. I'm all awesome. I'm glad you're... Uh, did I move into Luke's Island? Um, I think I, yeah, I kind of did, Jacob, definitely. Um, yep, I moved into his island a bit. Well, I mean, now that we're gardening a bit, we could uh, finish up with some of this. I kind of meant to put more sweet potatoes here. So I might as well do that. Man, I'm feeling so hot, but maybe that's because I use the oven and I've been around hot water a lot today. Okay. And then today we're going to try to do, since we already finished some of Scrooge McDuck's uh, quests, we're going to do some of Goofy's quests too. Alright, so I'm, I'm trying to make this look a little better. These gardens look a little bit more even. I think I have, I think this is, um, actually, well, actually, I can see what I, what I tore up. Okay, that's actually broccoli. So. Oh, I don't have any yams with me, so. One, two, three. All right, so we need to buy about ten, ten yam seeds to finish that little yam plot over there. Okay. All right, so we got our yam seeds. Yeah, I mean, they do make this very convenient. That's for sure, the eyes. Yep. I guess I kind of uh, was inspired. I kind of wanted to play the OG Animal Crossing because I've been playing so many Animal Crossing clones lately. All right. So, yeah, I'm guessing you could make, you could probably move this ancient core or this ancient gardening thing. You could probably move it to different um, areas. All right, so we could get some, I don't, they don't have any uh, broccoli seeds right here, but we could uh, go get some broccoli seeds. Um... Yeah, really interesting. So that's really cool. Um, let's see. Okay, so place any ancient machine in the glittering dunes. So now he wants me to place an ancient machine in the glittering dunes. So I guess we'll just have to pick this machine up and place it in the glittering dunes so that we can complete the quest. All right, so we removed it. We're gonna place that in the glittering dunes then. Um, let's go over here. Hi, Goofy. Goofy's like, why am I on the thumbnail if you're not doing any of my quests? I don't know. I don't know, Goofy. I feel like as you progress the game more and more, it's like, ah, uh, things just become easier and easier. It's like, oh, I can, you know, I have bigger and bigger amounts of storage. I have better tools. Uh, I almost feel like I'm cheating because the game gets easier. All right. I think those are, um, yeah, that's broccoli. This is celery over here. Okay. And there's wheat. Alright, so we can place um, our awesome uh, ancient uh, core thing.
So we'll just place it here where the broccoli is. All right, and I'm actually going to see if I can buy some more broccoli. I don't really know where you can get it from. Um, I don't know if they're... Honestly, I have to run all the way over here just to find the broccoli. Okay, here we go. This is what I'm talking about. All right, so we've got broccoli. Why they're selling broccoli in the desert, I have no idea. Okay. All right, let's try to sell something here. All right, I'm gonna sell a bunch of stuff that I have that's extra. I guess I'm gonna sell this broccoli and this wheat because I'm probably not gonna use that. And we'll sell this coal because I don't really need that and that. Okay, that's fine. All right, now we can buy broccoli, okay. Yeah, the one game that really doesn't hold your hand at all is, is the Polya game. That game, even though it's, you know, the graphics aren't the best, it's fr it's definitely frustrating. Okay. Alright, never mind. Okay, so now... So, where is Mr. Scrooge? Uh, Scrooge McDuck, where are you? Well, I have no idea where Scrooge is. Why is there not a Polo Justice anime yet? I don't know, uh, PJ. That's a good question. It's mind-boggling. <laughs> Alright, we literally have to run across the whole desert to do this. Okay, so let's uh, try this out now. All right, I don't think we actually need to do this for the quest, but we'll just do it anyway. So let's harvest it. And we can plant the seeds. Uh, select seed type. We're going to plant broccoli. And I'm going to plant it. And now we can actually try to water it. No, we can't water it. I think it is watering it. All right, now we can water it over here. And we can plant one more here. All right, so we planted more broccoli. All right, now we can go see if we can find Scrooge. Uh, Scrooge, where are you? Where did he go? His quest is over. I guess his quest is done. Oh no, here we go. Um, I'm guessing we could find Scrooge in his, um, re his, uh, store. A lot of times Scrooge is hanging out in his store, so maybe we can go find him there. So I guess I'll just morph back over here. Polly feels like a Genshin Impact clone. Yeah, I thought about playing in Genshin Impact as well. Good day, dear. Okay, when you've done it, you rebuilt an ancient machine. <laughs> hey, turn to the eye will be running itself before long. And I will make all the... I'm just glad this will help everyone. Uh, ah, okay, when you're always thinking of everyone else, it warms my heart. But you deserve some consideration, too. Here's a little something for yourself. While I was adventuring around the aisle, I found something that you might find useful for making more of those machines. It's been a pleasure consulting with you, Eternity Isle. So we're just about taking care of herself. Oh, we got another ancient core! Village, gear loose, and fancy free. Complete. All right. 
All right, so you know what that means. We got another ancient core, so that means we can actually uh, make something else on our table. So let's try it. So let's try more upgrades of our machines. So we can get an upgrade of our large pickaxe for copper rocks or large pickaxe for star... Starlight pickaxe potion. Large glass star stalagmite pickaxe. Large copper pickaxe potion. Well, I think I'm going to do the... Um... Oh, happy birthday, Tim. Have a, I hope you're having a great birthday. <sighs> All right. Large uh, glass uh, uh, stalagmite pickaxe. I think I'm going to do that one. Haven't continued it recently, Jacob Orion. I thought about doing it. Um, of course, I, I need something I can do on the Switch because Luke is always covering games on the PS4. All right, we're going to upgrade this with the ancient core that Scrooge gave us. And I know exactly what I'm going to do with that. I think I know exactly what I'm going to do with it. We're going to go to the Dune Desert. And I'm going to go right over here. Oh, yeah, of course. I hope you're having a wonderful birthday, Tim. Thank you for um, hanging out with, uh, with me and everyone here on your birthday. That's very, that's very sweet of you. Okay, guys. So um, I believe this is going to get rid of these things. Yep. So now we can get rid of these really big... Uh, giant spiral things and okay so because we can do that I know there's a place we couldn't get by last time because we didn't have this yet All right, so I'm gonna check on that And then after that, when we have time, we're going to try to catch a few fish with Goofy that he really needs. Alright, so we finally... So that special glass pickaxe thing, we were able to open that. Um... And of course, that's the Cave of Wonders, um, which is always fun to go in. We... You can always go back in there if you want to. Which you really can't have a sand area in a Disney game without having the Cave of Wonders. Um, I thought there was an area in the here that you couldn't get past without with some without um getting rid of some glass things. Well, I guess I'll keep looking for it. Um oh here it is. So you have to go down here. I believe this was an area that was blocked off. Oh, you're going to go bowling this Saturday? Awesome, Tim Muller. That's fantastic. I hope you have a wonderful time bowling. Oh, right! So we open this area. It looks like there's not much here except for this this area. Okay, and let's see what we got. And we got a coat hanger. This That's all we got is a coat hanger. Wow. That's what we got after all of that. <laughs> One coat hanger. Wow. I feel like this was a little anticlimactic. Like, I really thought there would be more here. I thought this would open it up another area. Wow. That's all we get is a coat hanger. I was so, I was so, like, 
I was wondering, like, what could be behind that area? Like, what what cool, mysterious thing could be behind there? Why a coat hanger? I have no idea. I feel like I was gypped. I, I was... I was really excited about, darn it, I feel like I'm stuck here. I was really excited about getting to that area, and now I realize it's a coat hanger. Alright, so we completed um, Scrooge's quest. We are, I guess we're just going to go back and we're going to go fishing with Goofy. Try to get some rare fish for his quest. Alright, and this area we need like 6,000, which we could open that area up, but I'm kind of waiting for like a bigger area. I'm kind of waiting to get 10,000 uh, missed points. Okay, so I have 5,000 now. And um, just if anyone is wondering, the... The shop right now has a cool purple cottage. You can get Pizza Planet if you want to. Which, I don't have enough uh, moonstones for that. You can get Mike and Sully. You can get a cool uh, outfit for um, Scrooge. And you can get this really cool TV. But I don't actually have enough. But I almost have enough. I'm literally 200 away. So I could get that cool... Um, I could get conceivably get that cool TV at some point. And I don't know. We have... Alright, 2,000, so we are nowhere near the 10,000 we need to open that. Whoops. We can get rid of one of these huge things over here. So, basically we can open up a lot. Oh! Let's see. Oh, we can actually open up this area, so that's cool. We open up a new area down here. Um... Oh, wow. A lot of thorns. And another chest. If this is another coat hanger, I am going to be pretty disappointed. Please don't be a coat hanger. Alright, another thing from the Sword and the Stone movie. And... Goofy's like, wow, you just kept me around just for nothing, didn't you? Didn't you, Amber? Um, yeah. So we just got like 500 coins or something. I couldn't really see how many. A couple hundred coins. And we got some kind of special memory. Um, let's see. Sometimes I can almost hear LeFou calling. Don't miss him that much. Do, do I? Gaston miss someone? Never. He must be out there. Yeah, so Gaston is like talking to himself in the desert going crazy. <laughs> so, um, I guess Don, I guess we can go talk to Gaston. Ah, you just can't stay away, can you? I'm not surprised. Tell me about yourself. Well, I'm known as the greatest hunter in the world. Wolves, boars, I've hunted them all. Go ahead, name an animal. Um, what about bears? Those thieving behemoths, they steal any food that's not nailed down. No such beast will menace the village while I am around. Thank you, Gaston. Alright, so let's actually try our best to uh, go back and we're going to see what kind of fish we can find um, when we go back to the docks. Maybe it's a coat! Yeah, exactly the eyes. Oh, thank you. I love the Mickey shirt your character has. Thank you. Um, thank you, PJ. Yeah, I don't know when I got, when we got that. Um, yeah, thank you. I appreciate that. It's almost like yeah, I think Luke has two different, Luke's character has two different Mickey shirts. Um, okay, so now we're just gonna, uh, see if we can get a couple exclusive fish here. And let's see if we can, this is the... The quest with Goofy, where we're supposed to get some rare fish. So, we might want to look for some of the bubbles that have, like, more rare, um... More rare type fish. That one doesn't look like very rare one. It was like a normal fish. I really don't like how that fish looks with both eyes on the same side of it. It kind of freaks me out. 
All right, here we go. So this is Goofy's quest. We need to find one more dune hopper and one prism, prisma ship. Shrimp, not ship. Shrimp, okay. Um, we're gonna try to drop this on the ground. Okay, we'll drop that. All right, we got an octopus, yay. I love how Goofy literally just sits there and stares at... Stares at you there. Okay. Hey, Goofy. We might be able, I think a dune, I don't know where we get a dune hopper from. Maybe we have to go to the sand area for that. Um, does anyone know where the dune hoppers are? Are they in the sand area? Oh, looks like we did get a, uh, we did get a, uh, collect three fish thing. I'm guessing it would be the sand area, because sand dunes, that would make sense. Oh, the grove area of the grassland? Okay, thank you, um, the eyes. Appreciate that so much. Thank you. Alright, well, I guess I'm gonna drop- what am I gonna drop on the ground? I guess I'll just drop these bones on the ground. Alright, we got another robot fish. Okay, I'm probably gonna have to clear out my inventory at some point. Okay, um, I guess I'm gonna eat some of these straw- I'll eat four of these. Alright, there we go. I ate some of my food and now I can actually get a few more fish. So why don't we try to go where, uh, the grove is where the pris prism shrimp are. Oh, the grove, okay. Okay. Um, doesn't look like I, let's see. Oh, the grove is up here. Okay. Thank you, the eyes. Uh, thank you for the help. I really appreciate that. Thank you. The Goofy movie is an amazing movie. One of my favorite Disney movies. Awesome, PJ. Yeah, I love the Goofy movie, too. It's a really great movie. And there's Buzz Lightyear. We can say hi to him. Greetings, citizen. Um, collect them all. Ah, I've been getting reports of a lot of squeaks coming from the mystical cave. Seems worth investigating. There's no telling where they might be hiding today, so I recommend you keep an eye out while you do regular rounds in the village. Okay, the mystical cave. I don't even remember where that is. Okay, alright, so we're gonna try to... I think we're in the grove area now. Okay, we are. Alright, so we're going to try to uh, find some fish in this area if we can. Alright, we got a something. I don't think that was a dune hopper though. I think that was salmon. Okay, salmon, yep, okay. All right, I'm just gonna put these, I'm gonna drop that on the ground and um, I'm gonna drop these sticks on the ground. And I really do need to get, uh, clear out my inventory at some point. All right, so, okay, let's try Ooh, an electric eel. That's exciting. Uh, not what I needed, but pretty cool anyway. And I believe you can use electric eels to make, like, special, uh, machines in this game. 
Because it's electricity, like to make uh, ancient machines. Another salmon. All right, well, we're just going to kind of hang out with Goofy. We're going to see what we can get. I don't know how far we'll get with this. All right, we got another piece of salmon there. I guess we're going to go up in the upper part of here and see if we can get more. All right, I'm looking for some circles I can put my... Uh... Oh, here we go, some golden circles over here. Yeah, so how many of you guys really are liking Disney uh, Dreamlight? It looks like some of you guys are really enjoying the game. What did I get? A Prisma Shrimp! Oh, wow! Now all I need is a Dune Hopper. Okay, you were right, the eyes. Okay, I got some cool stuff in this area. So this is the area to go to, guys and gals, for Goofy's quest. We got a perch. And two perch, actually. Alright, I'm just gonna drop that. I can't seem to get to those blue areas very well. Okay. Alright, let's see what I get next. It looks like Rapunzel has set up her thing. I don't know what fish that was. That was what? A piraruku? I don't know what that is. Alright, I'm going to put some of my flowers down so I can actually get some more... Um, so I can actually get some more fish here. It's really hard to get that circle way over there. More perch. All right, let's see if we can get this circle all, all the way over there. It's kind of hard to get. Wow. The game is not letting me get that very well. Yep, I can't really get access to that. Well, I guess I'll just, um... I don't know. I guess we'll try somewhere else because there's no way I'm going to... Uh, my, my fishing line is going to go that far. Well, we almost completed Goofy's quest. I don't know if we'll actually be able to get...
All right, more salmon. Oh, the do noppers in the oasis. Okay, thank you. Um, okay, thank you. Uh, 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 the eyes. Oh, the oasis. Okay, all right. We can try up there. All right, I probably should have looked that up myself. Actually, thank you for the help. Um, the eyes. Okay. Alright, so let's try seeing if we can find a dune hopper up here. Right, the eye says the dune hopper is probably in the oasis, so. Alright, we got a starfish. That was pretty cool. Whatever that was, it was not a dune hopper. Alright, let's try this um, blue thing over here. Oops. Okay, I'm just gonna drop the piece of bamboo, I guess. And we got a Duna! Dune Bopper! I thought it said Dune Hopper. Dune Bopper! Yay! Alright, let's go talk to Goofy. We got it. Dune Bopper, Robot Fish, and Prisma Shrimp. Awesome! Mm. Well, would you look at all these? Thanks, K-Wing. It's going to be a lot easier to catch them now that I know all the tricks. But say, I don't know any recipes for this stuff. Um, uh, Dune Prisma Shrimp Pop. Dune Bopper Sandwich. Uh, yuck, that might be something worth trying. Whoa. How about I take half of the fish and see what I can come up with? You, you keep the other half and do the same. I bet... Remy to have some tips if you want to ask him. Oh, and here, I got ingredients to get you started. Uh, whoops. <clears throat> Alright, I have to put something, uh, we'll, we'll drop this. Alright, we got ingredients to get started. A whole box of ingredients. Alright, so we should probably get our inventory um, all set up at home. Alright, we got catch three fish. So we got some dream light there or wisp or mist light. Dune Hopper looks like a fish with a giant zit on the side of its head, says the eyes. Uh, I'm so sorry about your seizures, um, Tim. I'll definitely keep praying for you about that. I'm so sorry. Over here. You're very brave to keep um uh to keep struggling through that, Tim. I'm so sorry about that. All right, let's talk to um Remy and see what he has to say. Hey, Ah, you and Goofy caught a bunch of weird stuff around Eternity Isle, and you need some recipes? 
Well, it looks like the ingredients Goofy gave you, you could already have it make a nice meal. Throw a Prisma shrimp, shrimp in with celery, butter, rice, and some spice. It'll be delicious. Celery, butter, rice, and spice. Celery, butter, rice, and spice. No problem. Celery, butter, rice, and spice. Okay, I'm going to have to remember that. All right, celery, butter, rice, and spice. I'm going to have to remember that. It's going to be hard for me to remember that. Okay. And... All right, so he said throw a dune hopper in with celery, rice, butter, rice, and spice. Okay. Bonjour. Ah. All right, I kind of messed that up. Ah. All right, let's let's give it a try. We're gonna try whatever he was saying here. All right, so let's put a dune hopper in here. Uh, dune hop, dune bopper, uh, key, celery, butter, rice, and a spice, any kind of spice. Oops, that's sweet. Okay, now we got spice. I guess we're gonna put paprika. I think paprika would be good. Alright, we made fish risotto! Mmm, sounds good. Yummy. Look at all this dream light. <laughs> You're doing quite well. All right, so let's see any other fish recipes we have. Um, we could try um, fish sandwich is just a fish and a piece of uh, wheat. And fish soup is fish, vegetable, and milk. So let's try those recipes. So... Um, Humans are robot fish and a piece of wheat. Let's make a robot fish sandwich. All right, we made a robot fish sandwich, I think. And now we can try the last piece of fish that we did. Um, we made, let's see, we did dune hopper. We did, uh, oh my goodness. All right, I think we have to go to the shrimp area, actually. Oops. No, that's not correct. All right, I'm going to go one Prima shrimp. I'm going to go one uh, vegetable. We're just going to put, like, celery or whatever. And then I'll go milk. And let's see if that makes anything. I don't know if it's going to. Oh, seafood appetizer. Well, we tried. Alright, so we made one with each of those ingredients. Now we can talk to Goofy. Tell me, pal, did you cook something yummy? I made something amazing, Goofy. That's great. I made a couple of things, too. Why don't you try them? I want to make a meat pie with all the fish in it, but I forgot to put fish in it. And then I got distracted and made cake by accident. But the cake turned out pretty good. 
Um, never be embarrassed about making cake, Goofy. Cake is amazing. <laughs> Give it a try. Maybe you could make one yourself. Okay. The one that got away is complete. So we finally finished that. Would I have or rather have fish soup or fish stew? Um, I think soup. I, I, uh... The one that got away completely. Yeah, I think I'd rather have soup. The eyes. Got, I'm more of a soup than a stew person. Because I feel like stew is more like less liquidy. And I like, I like the broth in my stuff. Like I like as much broth as possible. Um, so yeah. All right, guys and gals. Well, um, thank you, uh, everyone, for helping out. Thank you, the eyes, for helping me figure out where some of those fish were, and uh, and uh, we're I'm very happy. Goofy helped us out finding all those fish as well. So, okay, guys and gals, um, really appreciate you guys and gals uh, hanging out on the stream. I'm glad. Thanks for all the kind words. Um, thanks for hanging out, PJ, Game Wing, and. Tim and uh, Jacob and um, the eyes and everyone. Um, so I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and we'll see you guys in about uh, 10 minutes or so on the next stream. Thanks again for hanging out everyone and I'll see you guys soon. God bless. Happy gaming. See ya.